What's up, guys? Slime Green Beats in the hashtag building. And um, we're going to make a. I'm going to show you how guys had to make hi hats. So, hi hats for beginners. That's what this is all about. And uh, it's for beginners, but I'm going to go through like a real process, which is just like you want to match the hi hats with the melody as cohesively as possible. And um, I would say that is best done by find by getting good kits and then just catching a vibe, dog. All right, I suppose that made more sense in my head. I always try to get at least two layers of hi hat, whether it be an open hi hat or like two actual hi hats. And then like, I just throw a bunch of hi hats in here. See how it's like, I'm looking for like that soft, like kind of like, like nothing too crazy. And guys, number one rule is like, look, however you want to do hi hats, it's up to you. Uh, so that being said, let's get it going. Let's go to new pattern. Go ahead and lay the pattern down. Do a nice little six. This one's six for whatever reason, but like whatever you want to do in terms of like length is, is up to you. You can make it like 32 bar if you want. Um, I'm just gonna double it here so we can hear it the whole time. So you can just like right click here and hit every four steps, but like, and that could like be the answer for you to be honest. Like, I feel like the beats, a lot of beats I listen to are like really simple, just kind of like in the background hi-hat patterns. Like they have hi-hat patterns that like really don't stick out. And then there's like trap where it's just like, I don't really do that. Watch some of Stunner's videos. He has a hi-hat one. His is more like trap hi-hats. This is more like hip hop, like lo-fi, I guess. So that's something you can just easily do right there. Let's go in and then like, Try to get the hi-hat pattern that's in your head in FL Studio. So it's like, okay. So it's really that simple. Like, maybe this isn't the right, right, right open hi-hat, but we can just find another one after we record. So you're gonna want to put this in box mode. So turn everything down except for hold. Okay, so like, let's go ahead and get that recording. So we're just like going in, boys and girls. You can do whatever with this, like. For me, that's good enough, yo. Because this is a beginner tutorial, and honestly, like, the thing is, you want it to sound good, but um, it's about to find a different open hi hat, man. You know where there's a decent open hi hat? If you're if you don't have any of these kits, obviously, you can also go to Packs Legacy Drums Vintage has like a neat little one here. Probably doesn't fit perfectly, but like. Obviously, it's like so loud. That doesn't really fit, but like, you know. You get the points. That's cool right there yo um so get your sound cohesive try to get in your head before you lay it down that's hi-hats yo and a uh, good place to find hi-hats again if you don't have the uh if you don't have any of these kits which you probably don't drums legacy or sorry packs legacy drums all these have like hats pretty much this hip-hop here this vintage also has hip-hop good ones Harsh too, man. Man, dog. Our dog, man. Turn this down, fam. Just like that. Velocity. You could even. 
you can even go a step further and like up the velocity on one of these that you think is gonna pop like say it's like watching hi hats for beginners complete complete beginners let me go over like one more two more tips which is like you can right click here four two eight and that'll do it for you a lot of the times and then if you just want to record something manually you can always do that just hit the record button and just be like if you have something different in your mind but yeah that's it for this vid dogs peace out